I was just telling Langston here um, when I got Star for her birthday. So uh, we're cool? Uh, sure. Great. Well, you guys better head on over to Capricorn because I have planned a birthday bash for the birthday girls. It's set for a queen. Okay? okay. Have a good time, guys. Yep, we will. All right. Grab my purse. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Bye. I thought you were supposed to be at work. Well, Chris got me loose. He thought I might want to spend the day with you. Well, remind me to thank him later at the party. About that. What? Uh, well, Ford was at Buenos Dias with Chris, and um, we kind of... No, you didn't get into it with him again, did you? Not exactly. What do you mean, not exactly? It means I wanted to, but I took the high road. So you didn't say anything? Uh, even better. I invited Ford to Capricorn tonight. What did you do that for? So is it Skylar's or mine? No, don't look at her. She can't help you now. What makes you think this baby's yours? Uh, we spent the night together? <laughs> because you were totally wasted. What makes you think we had sex? Because you told me we did. Oh, come on, Oliver. You've known me long enough to know that just because I say something doesn't mean it's the truth. <laughs> oh, that's reassuring. Don't judge me. He's the one who was too drunk to remember what happened, okay? Oh, come on. I know when I have sex with a woman. Because of all your experience? Oh, just because I'm gay doesn't oh, mean that... Oh, please. I you wouldn't know your way around a woman with a GPS. Okay, it doesn't matter what happened. The baby is Sky. How would you know? I, there was nothing on your chart about CVS. Is she supposed to know what that is? It's chorionic villi sampling. It tests for abnormalities in the fetus, but it's also a paternity test. And it could hurt the baby, which is why I wasn't about to... prove Rex isn't the father. That's it. Enough of your scare tactics. Oh, this is not scare tactics, sweetheart. This is real. All this stress isn't good for Stacy and her baby. Yeah, it's not just her baby. It's not yours either. I want you out. All right, fine. Fine, but if we leave here without proof of that baby's paternity, we're going straight to Rex and Skylar. And once they find out what we have to say, there won't be a moat big enough to keep you safe. What are you talking about? Ross is your dad. He is. Was, in every way that counts, except for the one that my mom lied about. Todd Manning is the one that got her pregnant. I'm... I'm sorry. I... I don't know what to say. It's okay. I don't know what to say either. Like there's some... some guidebook. What to do when you find out your life's been a lie. I wish I could have had a copy of that. Wait, this happened to you too? Yeah, I'll tell you the story some other time. Sure. Maybe we can start our own club. So after all these years, Ross and your mom were lying to you? Well, my dad had nothing to do with it. My mom decided to screw with our lives all by herself. So why is she telling you the truth now? Because it doesn't matter how far my mom gets away from Todd. She can't let him go. So she wants to be with him? I don't know who's sicker. Todd Manning for everything that he's done or my mother for loving him. So now that she knows the two, she's going to want it all, isn't she? <sighs> like leading her through a minefield. She doesn't know anything about me? Mm. Nothing except the fact that you're her father. She doesn't know anything about Star or Jack or Sam. Or anything else from my colorful past. I didn't think it was my place to tell her. She's gonna find out sooner or later. I can't keep it secret. You have to tell her, Todd. You have to be the one to tell her. Yeah, I know. You're not the only one with some explaining to do. After all this, oh, Daniela's not going to look at either one of us the same way again. You know, I think there's a flight leaving for Tahiti in half an hour. I'm not going without you. <laughs> Are you sure? I love you, Todd. We can get through this together. I know we can. Thanks for coming back to me. Thanks for being here for me to come back to. Where the hell else am I gonna go? I guess part of me was scared you'd go back to Blair. Thanks for not doing that. Todd, how are you feeling? What's going on here? Nothing. I tripped. That true? Oh, I merely wish to spread the word of the Lord. There's no solicitation on the property. 
What, I can't uplift the barren multitudes? No, without a permit, for long. Very well. Mm. Please keep in mind what I said. You two and your little hope will always be welcome in my church. Oh, and, um, Star. Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs>